Hello and welcome to another video of Viceverse. Are you tired of scrolling through the same old boring images on the social media feed? Do you want to impress your friends with some unique and custom images? Well, you are in luck. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to use the Midjourney bot on Discord to create custom images from simple text prompts. But before we get started, there are a few things we need to cover. First and foremost, the Midjourney team has a strict code of conduct that we need to follow. Don't be a jerk, don't use their tools to create inflammatory or inappropriate images and always be respectful to the people and the team. Simple enough, right? So first of all, to use the Midjourney, you will need to join the Midjourney Discord server. For that, just go to the Google search bar and type Midjourney. Now head over to midjourney.com and click on join the beta to get started. Once you are on the Discord server, make sure you are logged into your Discord account. If you don't have a Discord account, you can simply create one easily by registering yourself. Now you are on the Midjourney Discord server. On the left hand side, you will see multiple channels. You can go through each of them to have a proper understanding of what's going on in Midjourney, what are the new announcements, what are the recent changes, what are rules, etc. and everything. Now, to start your journey towards creating your first AI art, you need to get into any of the channels. If you are new to Midjourney Discord server, don't worry. There are designated newbie channels that will help guide you through the process. Look for any channel that starts with newbies in the left sidebar, just like this. There are multiple of these channels and you can choose any of these. Now that you have found a newbies channel, it is time to start creating your custom images. To do this, we'll be using the slash imagine command. This command generates a unique image from a simple and short text description, also known as a prompt. Type in slash imagine prompt followed by a description of the image you want to create in the prompt field. Hit enter to send your message and watch as the bot processes your request. As we are hearing a lot about AI taking over the world, so I just try creating an art relevant to it. I just give a command slash imagine prompt a beautiful robot girl standing on planet Mars and she has a Persian white cat on her right shoulder. They are looking at Earth and are planning to conquer Earth. The scene is mesmerizing yet dark. Now I'll just wait for my journey to process this. Ta-da! Our imagination is in process of being converted to reality. Just wait and watch. As we are currently using the free version, we can see that there are a number of people who are giving their commands right into this window and the Midjourney bot is creating art for them. So uh, we will just have to look for what exactly it is creating for us. So I will just have to you know scroll down through this window to find what it has done for me. So after about a minute, the Midjourney bot will generate four different image options for you to choose from and here it goes so this one is ours so midjourney has created four images for me wow isn't it amazing getting your imagination converted into a real artwork just using midjourney well each image is created using your free trial time so use it wisely you can create roughly 25 jobs before needing to subscribe to a plan if you want to upscale an image or create variations, just click on the U that is for upscale or V that is for variation buttons. You can even rerun the original prompt using the refresh button. 
as there are multiple messages in this particular window so to make my life easy and find the messages in which vice first is being tagged i'll just go towards the search button i'll click on mention and i'll type my username mid journey will bring all the messages in this window where i have been tagged so i will be having a summary of all the messages where i was tagged and all the work that this mid journey bot has done for me and from this particular window i can then just choose any specific message for instance i like this one so i'll just choose it and i'll go towards the main message and here i can check that i can make variations i can do the light up scale redo i can do the beta up scale redo and right now i'm going for the light up scale redo and now i'll let my journey do its job for now and here I can mark this as my favorite one. Now I would want to open this in browser so I can just go to another page and I can you know download it. And if you go to the web page, it will take you to your home page on my journey. And in this home page, you can see everything that you have created up till now in the bot. So, you know you can get all the variations in a single place that's kind of easy for you so you can also rate your images on my journey once you have created your custom image it's time to show it off to the world click on the smiley face buttons to rate your image or other images in the mid journey community you could even earn an hour of free fast mode time each day by being one of the top thousand image raters. You've already seen that we can save the images so it's time for you to save your custom images. Simply you can click on the image to open it up to full size. You can right click and then save the image. If you are on your mobile just long tap on the image and then tap the download icon in the top right corner your images will be available to view on midjourney.com slash app uh, so as we have already discussed that when you are using the free version of midjourney you can only create your r25 times and now if you want to play more with the midjourney app and you want to create more art with midjourney you can just go to the midjourney.com slash app and there you can just go to the manage sub tab and here you can see that there is a subscription plan for anyone so there are three kind of plans first one is basic one then standard and then the third one is pro plan from these three plans you can just uh, check that which one exactly suits your requirements and you can just start making endless and limitless number of arts with this med journey app by just subscribing to any of these so that's it for the subscription plans you are now a pro at using the mid journey bot on discord to create custom images so go ahead get creative and let your imagination run wild as you have seen using the mid journey bot on discord can lead to some amazing and unique creations but what does the future hold for AI art? Well, with advancements in machine learning and neural networks, the possibilities are endless. We may soon see AI-generated art being sold in galleries and museums, and even being used for advertising and marketing campaigns. But one thing is for sure, the role of AI in the creative process is only going to increase. And who knows, maybe one day, we'll be collaborating with AI to create truly groundbreaking works of art. So don't be afraid to experiment and push the boundaries of what's possible with the AI art. The future is bright and it's up to us to shape it. Thanks for watching today's video and happy creating. For more mid journey tutorials, prompts and hacks, follow Wiseverse as we would be diving deep into mid journey in our upcoming videos. Till then, adios.